It's the first round of a buddy's trip. All the anticipation, the planning, the group texts, and the memes have led to this. A week at one of the most premier golf resorts in the world, and one that we had to wait patiently through a two-year wait list to get here again. The golfing gods have blessed us with one of those rare windless mornings at Bandon, which does nothing but ramp expectations for what is about to happen. The boys play three on one against me in a little low ball competition. It's basically two 11 handicaps and a five against a one to spice things up. Ready? Yeah. What's up, Sticks and Hacks? We are at Old McDonald at Bandon Dunes Golf Resort. The weather couldn't be better. Sun's coming up, marine fog's burning off. We got the ghost tree in the background. Let's go. And we're off, first swing. So are we doing three on one, Sean? Yes, we are. All right. We got this deal where we've been playing three versus one against him every time. <laughs> we gotta talk about those pops, though. The pops gotta get sorted. My handicap went up to 15 last night. <laughs> Oh, that's gonna need to be a breakfast ball. <clears throat> Dallas, up that left side, dude. That left far side. trap is kinda reachable. The not snap hooky is hella breeze. Not quite that left. Yeah, but it's, it's fine. It's totally fine. We're not used to people listening to us so early. <laughs> <laughs> You guys are following directions well. Snap hook left. Can you tell that? my wife that? She doesn't believe that. <laughs> no. She doesn't believe I can follow directions. And the nervy swings start right away with the three of us pulling it into the left rough. Oh, Miller. You can see Miller's ball up there. I'd split that in the flag. That should do it. Okay. You want me to land at 55? Yeah. Or 55 total? No, no, play, play 55. Okay. Yeah. There you go. A little short of 55, but uh, it rolls out. I don't hate it. Lowe's has a good look to start the trip with a birdie. Do it. Oh, oh good. Oh. Run at it. It's wow. going to take a little bit to settle into this round. Do it. Oh, oh there we go. go. Sean pours one like in to get started. Yeah, good dude, just off your feet trying to go that way. <laughs> <laughs> Great putt. Make this to win the hole. Yeah, no more than that. Just give me some uphill pace. Of course it is. Starting the round, much less the trip, with a birdie is going to do nothing for lowering my expectations. The course is defenseless at the moment. Mm. Los misses his par putt, and even with the bomb from Sean, my birdie is enough to take a one-shot lead after one hole. This was one of our early rounds. It's a little brisk, I haven't hit an iron in nearly an hour by this point, and it feels unbelievably still on this tee box. See you there, 45 definitely is safe. You get the backstop, so if you're a little in between, you know, maybe right, take we'll a little look. extra. And... It's a little between play, that's all right. You got a nine? I got a nine. Yeah. Hit a soft one. Yeah. Just cause there's, it's a there's, little, yeah, little but there's cool little, in the air. Exactly, and there's that's a little breeze up there. I just, I trust that nine. Okay. We were drooling over that one in the air, but somehow my 150 club went less than 120 yards. We'll chalk it up to nerves. Guess it took too much off. That's not gonna do it. This leaves one of those typical abandoned bunker shots. Almost sitting on the grass, I can barely fit between the ball and the bunker's edge. Shot, Come dude. on, sweetheart. I can't <clears> hit shot. that better than Great that. Great shot. Hands barely clearing my legs, and I used the slope brilliantly. Six feet for par. Oh, yeah. Easy shot, Carlos. Let's knock it up there. Oh, oh, what? Oh. Oh, far. The greens at Old Mac are huge, but they're also undulated. You have a lot of circus putts. Big breakers like this one from Sean. You either need imagination or a good caddy. Strong side. I think we can start it at that piece of dirt before we get there then. You know what I mean? Well done. 
face, dude. Do it. Oh, oh man, that was a beautiful putt. putt. Lowe's two putts for bogey. Beautiful putt. Thank you. Hit a house. Miller misses his par, and I've got just six feet to force Sean to make his. Nope. Good putt, but that's a bogey. One ball right and a hair Sean has a chance to tie the match. Oh, good run at it. The third hole is a signature hole at Old Mac, right over the ghost tree. The best logo on the property in my opinion. The tee shot feels intimidating the first time you see it as it's blind over a big hill, but the landing area is generous and I don't need to hit driver. This club is typically a weapon for me, but early in the morning, having only hit one iron up to this point and being a little nervy, it's not my favorite club. I had nightmares of f***ing Carlos in that, with that club. Let's rewind for prosperity to two years ago. Is this a good image for your last swing thought? The good news is that's a free drop. It's all ground to repair. Drop that. My last thought was Carlos last year. <laughs> last. I know what Carlos did. Carlos, it sounds like he's blaming that shot on hey, you. Man. Uh, no, I'm blaming it on I'm my not, mental. I don't know if I'm buying into that. <laughs> it's a little long. You've got an uphill putt coming back to it, right? right. Short. You kind of get put tumboed and back away from you. Okay. All right, at it, man. You got room on both sides, I just go at it. Okay. It's assuming I can see it. Which I cannot. Oh, I can't hit that better. That may be deep. I was at it. We'll see. Ooh, I like hearing that. 10, 12 feet, let's go. Especially when I laid up off the floor. Good shot. Good shot, Lowe's. Anyway, Lowe's. Sean with a good birdie look to get on the board, but you're gonna see some nervy putting early in this trip. Really push it to your right. Okay. I'd say it's up in here. I like it. Yeah, well, I'd call it two feet, man. That's what I was feeling. At least a foot and a half with the pace you gotta put on it. Pretty quick. Yeah, I'd say the first, first 80% is pretty quick and it kind of levels out. Just okay. a little down. Easy money. That's my first putt over six feet, and that's a nervy one from me as well. I was expecting the greens to be fast, but that's not really abandoned. Lose and Miller with easy pars means I have to make this putt to keep yeah, pace. Yeah, you know, you're not gonna have any down from here. I like that. I like that line. This is pretty flat from here. Like that? Yep. Great awesome. bar. Good yep. bar. Thank you. Uh. <laughs> kind of going just left the steps. Mm -hmm. See, now I've watched, I remember too much about mm -hmm. last time. That was when Miller hit it way left. He's like, is that left? <laughs> That's left. Just right over that little part in the bunker, you can see. Right just left of those bunker right in front of the stairs. Oh, yeah, gotcha. yeah, for a line. Right there. Oh, even left of the stairs? Yeah, yeah, yeah okay. for sure. I tend to have an almost photographic memory when it comes to golf. I can remember almost every shot I've hit in the last several years. Sometimes that's my curse, because despite being told about all the room on the left here, I remember blocking my tee shot two years ago, way right over the bunkers. Terrible golf swing that was. I'd like to pretend that I wasn't thinking about last time, but I was. Knowing I went right last time and Miller pulled his way left, I felt a snap hook coming on. Don't hit it left. So of course, I completely bailed. Your brain doesn't do well with don'ts. I'm back into it now. Come on, Dallas. Oh, we're over three. Three out of four of us struggled with this tee shot, which is ridiculous. It's a little visually intimidating as you can't see a lot of the landing area, but the fairway is huge. There's no reason to miss it. Okay. Be our savior here, Carlos. Come on, dude. You can do Someone's got to hit this 150 wide, yard wide fairway here. Come on. There you go. Yeah, dude. Carlos to the rescue. Good job, Luke. Hey. 
and when you hit a bad drive, you get rewarded with these types of shots. See, I, I hit it over here just so that you'd have this epic shot yeah. view. And yeah. I did it for the content. I certainly, you know, didn't purposely or on accidentally hit it over here. Yeah. I believe you. Tangent is helping me visualize what's on the other side, but in this case, it's just a layup. When in trouble, get out. Am I covering this guy? Oh no, that guy. Okay. Right, so either lay up short of it or be long of it. I think you got plenty of nine. Yeah, I got room for nine. Yeah. Sure. Let's do it. What's where am I aiming? Basically the apex of this bunker. Let's go just yeah, right up the gut here. That'll keep you even left of that bunker anyways. Okay. That was piss poor. Ay ay ay. A little, uh, little stiff this morning. Definitely feel uh, restricted. Old, busted, <laughs> all the above. Old Max got her legs wide open for you guys, oh, man. You gotta I, take I, advantage I know. here. This is just Come ridiculous. On. That's what I'm kind of kicking myself up. I probably need that camera. You couldn't ask for a better day. Are you gonna go hit that golf shot? I don't know if, I, have I made a par yet? I did make one par. All right. I did make one par, you're right. You can hear my mind is a bit all over the place this early in the trip. A long travel day the day before and then expectations and just wanting to play well can make it hard to settle in. But I'm proud of the attitude I've had so far. Let the golf come to me. We're right at it. Right. This will be an adventurous par. Hold it a little down, down, down. Really good. Good shot. Thank you. Oh, we gotta try to park. We're grinding early. Weather is perfect. We're going low today. Just be patient with me. Uh, I'd call it half a ball. Really not doing much. In this pace, you're just kind of here. Okay. Turn. Turn. Oh, yeah! Oh, no! <laughs> We're already making more putts than we did two years ago. Let's go. <laughs> I told you you were making bombs. Yeah, yeah, that was awesome. That's awesome. <laughs> birdie on the number one handicap pole. Dude, and it's, uh, it's, let's call it straight right center. I like that. Yeah. If anything, it's just going to try to peel my way. I like that. Well, I like your call. I think it's kind of just right in the heart. I've got a tough little par saver here and a good strike, but it misses low. We'll mark that in the Tangent app. That means Los has just over eight feet for birdie to get two shots back in the match and take the lead. Oh, what birdie. Three. Well done. Thank you. Nice, Los. Three, man. Good bird. That's so great. That hole was uh, hard. 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 The green on the fifth is massive, but very undulated. A series of bowls where they can put pins, some real chances for hole-in-ones, but if you miss the correct bowl, the putts can be wild. The only thing you can't do is miss this green to the right. I knew that was coming. Well, circus putt. Hold. Three nine. Get lucky. Not lucky. Mm. Ooh. Ooh. Keep your head up. Hmm. Good. Good, good shot. Good shot, Sean. Thanks. Tough little pen. Yeah. I was a bit in between clubs here. The AI caddy said 48 degree, but I felt like I had mishit a few irons. It's chilly, so I went with an extra one, pitching wedge, and flushed it. Circus putt upcoming. Okay. All right. A couple circus putts. Well, after hitting two kind of. Didn't a little go. short, you want to, yeah. Nope. Maybe we need that one more try and say a little bit. What's that? Maybe come out this way a little bit. Take that, yeah, fair enough. that lip out of play. Yeah, it's not a stance. It's just not fun. So oh, trying to switch no, 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 no. Last one. Last try at this. Don't hurt your elbow. There you go. All right. <laughs> Oh, never mind. It's like a self-fulfilling prophecy right there. Before we get all over Miller for making a mess out of that bunker, 
every one of us will be humbled in a bunker at some point during this trip. If you get out of position, they are hard, they're deep, and they're unforgiving. Carlos gives me a pretty a good teach here. that kick down here. Yeah, a little harder than he did. Yeah, and a little bit further left. Just try to... Mark that for me. Yeah, I got you. Thanks. Just try to bring the, that tail into play. Up where you just were or higher than that? I like it here. The flag stick is where I aimed. Yeah. I think if I hit it a little harder though, like yeah. where Matt is, then I can Absolutely. take that slow. Make, make me move from my yeah. spot here. Okay. It's weird aiming away from holes, but these caddies know what they're doing. They've seen just about every putt on the property. That's pretty good, yeah, dude. That's the curve we were looking for at the end. Oh, good spot. I think I'm gonna oh, take yeah. my. I love the kickback. There you go. Yeah, yeah not too much. shabby. I could have get you get a little further to the shot. right. Do it, Sean. Mm. And Sean, with an easy par putt, means I have to make mine. A little downhill. But not crazy fast. Hit it 90% of what you see. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. Do it. Come on. Uh, you got it putt. just outside. Yeah. Right center? Yeah. Yeah, good putt. Good putt. Thank you. And that's a heck of a two putt. We've got a good match going here. I'm down a stroke through five, and I'm only one over par. I like to think I'm nerdy off the golf course, but on it, I try not to but be. But he does soak his balls. I do not. He does soak his balls. I do not soak my balls. My balls are not soaked. Soak your balls, bro. Gotta get the Epsom salt out. And... The sixth hole is the first par five on the card, and the par fives at Bandon are all pretty generous. They aren't crazy long when the wind isn't blowing, so just get it in play. Famous last words. I know better than this, but when you start talking about how big the landing area or the target is, you lose focus on a specific target, and that'll increase your dispersion every time. And I pull this. I'm just warning you, it's not good. Yeah, we are just trying to get it in play. Like a seven? Yeah. It's kind of think it's seven. Good downing. Oh, it's, it's soft. Yeah. It almost feels like someone, I don't know. I, I don't think it's gonna be too bad. Yeah, it's just kinda, yeah, it's soft enough. Just gotta kind of come down hammer. on it really hard. And yep. Maybe kind of hook the club just a little bit. Get it bounding out there somewhere, huh? Yeah. Oh, that sucks. Bad lie. Bad tee shot. Kind of deserved that one. Nah, I'd probably try to bound the five iron up there. Yeah. I like that. Yeah, scoot it up Here, there. I'll, I'll go what car was. Maybe a little bit left for the angle and okay. let's try and get a rolling up there. Yeah. Now this is a little better, a more sandy lie in the rough. It's still not great as there's a lot of sand behind that ball. Ah, kick left. Hard. We'll see. Another tough lie. Need to get this in the fairway. Oh, that's a nasty lot. God! Is it gonna go bad, huh? down towards the hole? Yeah, for sure. Absolutely. Okay. And kind of add it, it kind of funnels from both sides. Okay. You know, I can see it going a little left at the end, but, you know, yeah. pretty, pretty straightforward. Zip. Whoa! Gosh darn, it's like right. no grab. All right, we gotta make a putt. Try to save par. I haven't made many pars yet. A little shaky to start. We'll keep grinding. Yeah. Great yeah. Putt. Miller puts an easy bogey on the card. Los is struggling up one of the huge mounds. It's tough when you know it falls off on the other side. Nice. And Sean with a good lag and a shot at par. It's hung out there. And... With Miller and Lowe's in with bogey and Sean in tight for par, I need to make this to keep pace in the match. It owes me one. But 
I don't. Sean makes his par, and I'm two strokes back going into seven. I think that's two over through six. That bunker on the left is reachable, Carlos. So okay. Let's go. Yeah, we that, gotta get a good swing on one. I know. Get that aiming tight. Point. Okay. Tight. Yeah, I'm the same way, man. I don't think I've gotten back. That's why everything's left. Seven is such a cool hole. Pretty generous landing area, but the second shot is tough. It's way up the hill to an infinity green that you can't really see all of. But step one is get it in play. Perfect. Yeah, good ball. Very good. good. Yeah, really good. Hey. Found the club face. We're back, baby. We're back. <laughs> I was say, Watch it out. Sounded good. I didn't see it, but it sounded good. Watch out. We are seven holes in, and that's the first good drive I feel like I've hit. Welcome to first round nerves. Cut. <laughs> That might work. All right, guys, enjoy the rest of your round out there. Thank you. Guys are, guys are about a hole behind where you should be at this point, so just try to pick it up where you can. The guys at Bandon do a pretty good job of keeping the pace up. In this case, we weren't really behind, and we end up waiting on the very next tee box. But I'd rather them be proactive about it than complacent. After all, we have an afternoon tee time at Pacific Dunes that we got to make. This shot up the hill on seven is so cool, but it's visually intimidating. The walk up the hill to see the ocean for the first time is special. The sounds and visual of the ocean just kind of slap you in the face, and it's like, oh yeah, I'm abandoned. 45 right over my head. Like a flat spot, it's downhill, but it's a little slow. Oh, good run, good dude. Days for me. Okay. And it's just, I mean, I just got it here again. Okay. Yeah, it's gotta go a little bit. Just a ball. Just a ball, and it's not fast. Yeah. You know, give it, give it a nice little putt. Came off dead left. That's yeah, on me. Sure yeah. did. Now we turn away from the ocean to a cool par three. Huge green, but it has a huge valley that splits it in two. It's important to get it on the right half of the green. One six nine. Uh, do you like the number? No way. Just get the kick forward. We're gonna hit one more, guys. Sorry. There's hardly any wind, which is wild. I don't hit that great. Definitely toey. We'll mark that in the tangent app, but it finds the green and I get away with it. Good way, Carlos. Carlos with a great lag and an easy par. Good putt. Good putt. It's still gonna turn. Give it a little juice. Oh, more juice than that, Dallas. Followed by a really mediocre attempt from me, putting defensively so far. Gumption. That's not gumption. And I'm not alone. Oh, nice. There's a good putt. Good putt. Yeah, buddy. Anyway, yeah. Sean. Way to give it some weight. Out of it. Yeah. Just give me something solid. That's not solid. Man, I got enough. A little nervy putt so far. Right edge there, fella. A couple cups past the whole pace. Head still. Yeah, he did. You know what? Look at the mojo going. One short. One short. One short. <laughs> One short. <laughs> oh. Not uh, a little nervy so far. Not the best ball strike. That was like a nervy putt, dude. I had no reason to be scared of that first one. They're not fast, right? They're, They're not, not going to get away from you. They're not. I don't know why. Well, I did just switch putters. I, for two months, I was using the Scotty camera, this big heavy mallet. Like the, the thing kind of thing? Kind of, yeah. Okay. So I switched back to that one. I haven't quite adjusted the pace. Yeah. That one, I do a better job of getting on my run. What you... I the weight out. What did you like about the thing? Or the... I couldn't get a start on the line I wanted. Like, it was face bounce, but like, it felt like everything was slightly healy and left. I mean, I've used that putter for forever, right? Okay. 
One more hole in the opening nine at Old Mac. I'm two strokes back in the match and three over par. A little dogleg right where you can really cut the corner to shorten it up. Driver might be enough to go through, but as I said, the rough is generally reasonable. See how that releases like that? Yeah. There it goes. What's the total? 65. Okay. So I kind of just keep it at the shadow of the flag. Okay. 60 yards and just let it go. Just skip and sit. Zip. Zip. All right, uncle putt. You alright? Short hole, tough little approach on this green. After seeing some nervy putts left short, the boys went after it on this hole. Oh, settle. Hit it, do something. I think if they hit it with gumption. Settle, settle, settle. Gumption. Hit it. Oh, yeah. I finally hit a better putt out of the center, and it's an easy par to match Carlos. That's a 3 over 37 in the opening 9 holes of the buddy trip, and while I'm frustrated with the score, I'm letting the golf come to me. The first round in a buddy's trip is always a little bit tough. It's a day after a lot of travel, the nerves, the expectations, it can take a bit to settle in and find your groove. You gotta be a little extra patient, and the patience will pay off on the back nine at Old Mac. Thank you.